which comes right with the cleavage is it's a very <laughs> loose bow. <laughs> <laughs> I've been sitting here yes. for three hours so eager just to <laughs> untie it. <laughs> <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, the white part of the show tonight. <laughs> no, right here goes. <laughs> <laughs> Retire. <laughs> it, it, yes, and so it's <laughs> very the rapey part of the show. <laughs> 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 Back to selling panties. It's, it's <laughs> just you slightly rapey. Keep the, keep the <laughs> panties. I want Ricky to sell bras. That's what <laughs> we're making. Hey, hey, you you on the market. hey yeah. six figures. You can't knock six figures. Yeah. No. no. Oh, no. If I can sell mine, I'm down. No, yes. l- listen, there's a market, bro. No, actually, no, we, we, have a, we can start a business with uh, Ricky's used bras. We'll call it Opportunity Knockers. And that'll oh. <laughs> there you go, <laughs> Phil. <laughs> <Okay>. <laughs> That's it? That's it, yeah. All right, I learned that uh, we celebrated women this week. Love we never women. celebrate women. Love women. <laughs> mm-hmm. Love women. We never really we we celebrated women this week, and I didn't even plan it that way. Do we didn't plan it that Almost way? Almost every show just happened. Every show was just about all about women, which I is nice because last month was uh, Black Month. I, th- I think <laughs> I think we, I think we should celebrate women every day. Black Dick. It was Black Month last month. Um, w- uh, but here at PP, we're doing a lot of things different here this year. We're not doing a toy drive this year. We're not doing any anniversary drives. We're not doing all that. You're getting married too. It well, we're getting you married. are getting married. Yeah, if you, if, you, married. if you do do it, decide to do a toy drive, the Toys for Tots by the United States Marine Corps Reserve is a great cause. Um, yeah, we did them the first year, and we I'll talk to you about it. Yeah. <laughs> um, we did them the first year, but then we uh, went a different route by bringing actually bringing the toys to people that we knew that got them. Mm. Uh, we did good. it the that, first that, year, and the that, Marines that took it, them, that, and we that, didn't know where they went. That is a better feeling. Um, I. Because me, I actually we knew the families we helped this year. Yeah, when yeah, I when yeah. I got out of the Marine Corps, that that's so that's one of the things I did um, in the reserve unit was run toys for tots. But yeah. even having to set them off on a truck, I always felt like maybe where did they go? Yeah, maybe yeah, we could just give go, them. Yeah, yeah. yeah people want to know where their stuff goes. But uh, I learned that uh, what I learned, I learned that um, through patience and uh, listening to other people, that you can be there for the friends that you've. Call friends and uh, and, and, and m- this is goes out to Casey. Um, Thank you never give up on anybody, and no matter how many times they fuck up, there's a pushing point. But then you know when that person fucks up that they're actually crying for help. But anything. Mm-hmm. Long story short, without putting anybody out there, I'm glad that you're with us again. So I'm glad to be back. Muhammad yeah, Ali definitely. took his corner man back. Yes, he did. And uh, Max, thank you for thank coming you, back. Friend. You're welcome. I love you, bro. <laughs> Thank you for coming back. We're glad your mom's doing good. Hell yeah. And that, God uh, bless. One of the hardest working Puerto Ricans I know. You know, that's limited. Yes, sir. <laughs> yeah, I work. In between I work. you two. Yeah, yeah, we, yeah, we work. No, man. I'm kidding. I, I, um, and, and, and definitely the, the ethics this guy has is great, too. So, Most important part is A- ethics. And mm-hmm. he's, he's very yeah, yeah. true to what he does. And, you know, DJing isn't easy. It isn't. Uh. Yeah. Anybody can mix at a club, but you know what? You can't because you know what? It took me four years to beat mix, and everybody's like, oh, I can do that. You can't. No, it isn't. No, it's, it's you, it you, there's beat mixing, and then there's doing it flawlessly for four hours. And mm-hmm. I know I ask a lot of these guys every week, and I'm on them. I'm like, give me that shit, but you know what the problem is? Is they're in that room for that hour, and they'll get like 30 minutes into the tape, and they'll fuck up, and they're like, oh, I got to start all over again. You know what? We have, we have some people, some DJs, right? Yeah, I need DJ. some mixtapes, so if you want to send some, I, I'd love to extend it to the whole weekend. Right uh, now, I got my solid six. Wait, but we just we we have um, Darius's. Oh yeah, I got a brick. Whoa, yeah, that's you the know case. what? That's gonna be next time. Let's, yeah, we'll yeah, talk yeah, about we'll, that next time. Big time. The deadline is the deadline is Friday Friday afternoon. Otherwise, it doesn't make the server. Gotcha. So Friday whatever afternoon. they want to send it to us, I gotta listen to it prior to it. These are my. Main six right now, but we want to extend it to maybe two days on the yeah, weekend. Yeah, right? of course, of course. But right yeah. now, I got Max, I got Manny, I got Joe Antonio, I got uh, Dan Dinkins, I got Jamie. And uh, the more the merrier, though. I don't know about that other K. Yeah. He's a weirdo. Yeah. You're Charlie yeah. Bean, don't you? Yeah, not, uh, Charlie not, Bean, not so. up to par. <laughs> <laughs> no, he just he was gung ho in the beginning, mm, and then not, it's like uh, and then he didn't uh, give uh, a uh, shit uh, though. Exa- yeah. Exactly, he's not, he's he's not about it. Not yeah, about that. Life. It's not about that life. You gotta give it a hundred percent all the fucking time. It's like, yeah, I got a tape. I'll send it to you in two minutes, and I'm waiting by the email. It's like, all right, well, it's two weeks now. Everybody, everybody wants to shine, but they don't want to grind. Amen to that. Yo, right. So I know it's a lot of hard work, and I bust their balls, but it's a lot of hard work mm-hmm. because you want to send. Yeah, exactly. When you hear the mixtape, it's perfection. It's not. Yeah. It's not something like you hear like 
yeah. Back in, I mean, like... It, it shouldn't be half-assed. Right, like High 93.7, they, pre, they pre-record their shit, and these guys do it in a fucking bedroom or whatever they're doing. And yeah, yeah, yeah. And that's what's nice about us, though. Um, thank you guys and for showing us that, you know, you can came, come from an inner city and just overcome all them obstacles, especially people don't realize how hard it is to be... A resident of Meriden and to just to do something with yourself. Listen, you I know because I used to work in Meriden for 15 years. I know I that city's there, fucking yeah. retardedly like people are crazy there. Yeah. But but to just go not the people ain't riding in, in that yeah. city. No, they got good cheeseburgers though. <laughs> Ted's. Ted's, yeah. Ted's. Ted's. But to come from a, a city like that and have some kind of like vision, like the name of the company. Yeah, yeah. 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 I raised my drink to old, all three. Yo, drinks, drinks up to him. To actually, Pete. I, I raise my drinks coming. to you guys because Meriden <laughs> definitely is a place to come out of. And Phil, thank you for everything thank you do. Can I ask James a question one more time? Where can we see on TV again? Channel 5, 95, 96. That's on the Hartford Public Access Station. Also, what is I'm, it on Comcast? Um, <laughs> I'm, we have an on demand. I actually have to like talk to the director about it because I'm just starting to get approved because I'm getting sponsors and everything for it. Mm-hmm. So. I'm going to have my own on-demand page very soon, and it's a lot of the episodes are going to be going on online. So Does he remind you of Tampon Man? Tampon Man? Remember him? <laughs> we had a guy at a... <laughs> tampon Man? There was a guy, a black guy, he would stick a fucking tampon on his head and do a show for an hour, but he, <laughs> he had a lot of fucking people. He had a lot of ratings, man. Lot. He was on public head? TV. Because he was just like... He would put a... T- <laughs> no, he would literally unpeel a tampon and put it on his head for the whole show. What people would do for entertainment. But he would be like a controversial guy. Like every, <laughs> everything's like fucked up and fuck you and wow. <laughs> he, he was on the air for like fifteen years. Whoa, big time. That's what happens with controversy. Look put at how it's turned. Put a tampon on your head, bro. That's <laughs> it. Famous. That's I put ticket. a condom on your head. <laughs> <laughs> thank you, Phil. Thank you for everything you do, and oh. I don't want to thank everybody. You put a condom on, the on your head because I'm a mind fucker. I'm, I'm <laughs> Ricky, thank you for everything you do, and I love you, baby. I can't wait to marry you. We got our invitations and. Um, is Vision Company invited? That's what I'm saying. D- yeah. Listen. Exclusive. That's, that, that's the problem. Oh, here it goes. Listen. Yeah. Wait, See that's how it works. Happened was. <laughs> that's the problem when you have a lot of friends. The wedding, the private wedding is until 8 okay. because of family. Of course. But then we're going to open up the doors to people after 8.30. Okay, okay. It's a and Portuguese shit. restaurant. You Ooh. know how fucking Portuguese people get down. Hey. 8.30, I'm going to put a Facebook event on Max is working. Fucker. <laughs> uh, we're gonna after eight thirty. The doors are open. We just have to have the dinner private, fu- and then after fine. that is fucking I'm perfectly fine. I just want to yeah. go over there and say Balls congratulations. Yes. Yeah. So that that's the way you know what it is when grab you grab a bridesmaid, yeah, fucking wedding and stuff. Yeah. <laughs> Love you, baby, very much. Oh, that's one of them. See, X them out. You know what her daughter's <laughs> name is? It's Kayla too, and she got the same <laughs> attitude. Oh, we're the same attitude. I don't give a fuck. I eat a whole box of cereal and what? <laughs> <laughs> Whatever. I don't care if I don't pay for food. And look yeah. at me, I can eat that shit still. <laughs> exactly. I swear to God, they look alike too, right? Almost. <laughs> oh my God. She's a Sanchez, so all Puerto Ricans look alike at one point. A little bit. <laughs> a little bit. It's like yeah, Chinese yeah, people. Yeah, yeah. But thank you, everybody, for tuning in to Great Rika Radio. Don't forget to tune in to 24-7. And I want to say thank you to Kilogram and the Vision no team and DJ Max. We'll see him on Saturday. Casey, thank you, sweetie. See you on Sunday. Glad to be back. Love you. <laughs> Always with my brother. See you on Always. Sunday, uh, All Things Sports. And, uh, Phil, we'll see you on Monday with the movie show. The online movie show, 7 p.m. And, uh, Ricky, I'll see you and the twins in a few minutes. <laughs> Yay. Hey, you better hey. get it in. Everybody, hey. as we say them every show, stay Good black, day. y'all. Good Yo. night. <laughs>